I remember you said it was tough with the way that the young, them young, young bulls is like, mm -hmm. like, like. How was it being in studio with NBA Young Boy? He see when I when I was in the studio, like I could tell he then grew up. But when I was in the studio with him back in the day, he was just he was wow. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gonna talk. I, I think that's so dope the way you just explained that too, because a lot of times it's hard for kids to be uh how they say raised up hip hop what's that little show they had oh, growing, yeah. up, growing hip -hop. up hip hop it's hard as hell growing up hip hop <laughs> you know what I'm saying growing up hip hop shit yeah, that's another level bro they they be speaking on like Lotto and the show and all of that and I'm like hey y'all if Lotto wasn't built like that it wouldn't have happened you can't mm -hmm. I, I I could put anybody on TV I got friends that didn't fell out with me because they be like man introduce me to Gates and I be like bro I can introduce you to Gates you can meet them. He can do the world for you. But if it's not in you, you won't survive. You ain't never. Hey, it's niggas that want my, when it come to them shows, it's niggas that, it's niggas that be, man, why he get the duh, duh, duh. I'm like, bro, you want my, go. Go where I go. I go where you go. Let me go. I go, I open it up. You, 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 you go right. Man, ask me what that shit look like. Man, you got that. it got to be in you, bro. It got to be in you, man. When you think about, you know, you said something on the show a while back. You, you and you, I don't even know if you've been working with him lately, but Fred O'Bangs and being in the studio mm -hmm. with Fred O'Bangs. But even with NBA Youngboy, you just said, I know y'all might, he, you probably had to ship it to him because he on house arrest. Right. You probably didn't go in the studio with NBA Youngboy, did you? Who, back in the day? Yeah. No, I've been in the studio. You did? Yeah, yeah. Like, did, a couple times. You, you said, I remember you said it was tough with the way that, the young, them young, young bulls is like, mm -hmm. like, like. How was it being in studio with NBA Young Boy? He see when I when I was in the studio, like I could tell he then grew up. But when I was in the studio with him back in the day, he was just he was wild. He was wild. Like I I just went in the studio. I can't say everything because nobody. It, this the conversation that nobody know. I was in the studio with him and Moneybag Yo at the same time. Wow. And this is. Early money bag, early NBA young boy. So while I'm, I was in the studio with them for like a week, and it was so crazy. I've been in the studio. Let me give you. Let me give you, Let me tell you how crazy it was. I got NBA young boy, biggest record at that time. We end up working on the song. I play some beats. Pull it up. Boom. We pull it up. Right. He finished that. Pull up another one. Finish that. In the midst of that, I'm in the room. I'm making the beats, sending them to the computer. He's like, Mike, fuck out, let's put some Southside 808 Mafia beats on. I'm in the room. <laughs> <laughs> hey, <laughs> Bag, look at me like. <laughs> but, you know, he really ain't. See, Bag ain't say shit because he, you know, he he old, he, he, he adult like me. He kind of like. And I'm just like, damn. But that's how wild it is. And at the time, I personally, I'm just like, hey man, this ain't my this ain't my battle. You feel me? I, I didn't see one thing about me when I win. I'm trying to win some more with you, but if I didn't got my championship ring, man, I ain't gotta sit there and stay on the team, man. I ain't signing no contract or nothing like that. I can I can move around and I can find me shit. Niggas was on my ass. I, you don't do that. Hey, I make another one. What bang it? Come on, bang. That's why I want to, yeah, what's Let's the difference busy. between being in there with Fred O'Bangs and being in there with NBA Youngboy? Fred O'Bangs was wild at one point. That's what I'm saying, because he was wild and too at one point. <laughs> See, it ain't no comparison. I love both of them. I'm not going to do sure. none of that. But I will say, when me and Bangs started working, See, Youngboy was a little younger to where I don't think Youngboy, he was so young and wild, I don't think he knows me. Okay. That's crazy to say. You know how wow. you know how you young, you wild, you got so many people around, it's like you don't you don't know. He can't remember me. I wasn't a big deal or nothing like that. I was just a person who did work and did my job. Fredo was somebody who respected my work and my okay. job. So I got it. Two I, different time periods. That but also Fredo, wow, but he not so consumed it's like he had his street niggas with him and he knew who they was so he also knew these my street niggas but this the nigga i can't do business with in these rooms right here 
it was so many niggas the way you didn't know who was who. You might have had your street niggas and you knew who they was, but these rooms when you this big, you got ten niggas with money bag too that you don't know. It's just like man, here go another nigga with some ice on his chain. If if I could change everything all over again, I'd have walked in them bitches looking like CeeLo Green. At, I mean, not CeeLo, uh, Jermaine Dupri at the Super Bowl. I did had I did something to make myself stand out. Like bitch, you gonna remember me? <laughs> but I was forgettable. Let me just say that. That's hard. That's hard, but it's real, and and, I, and it's good that you take notice to how you know who you are. Your self evaluation is real. You know, mm -hmm. self awareness. That's a real thing, and, and I, I think that's hard that you look back, reassess, and say, you know, if I'd have did this, because now when you're in those situations, you know how to conduct and what you need to do to be yeah. successful. I'm start showing up with cowboy hats on. On the ass. Ice that. No shirt either. Nigga, I'm not want to be in the studio with me. Man, hey, get this nigga up out the studio, man. <laughs> man. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.